games to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. And here we have Manchester City against Arsenal. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beck. Cheers, Peter. It's a privilege to be here. It really is. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, Peter, here's someone I really like the look of in Ruben Diaz, uh, a proper defender. Someone who, who does the simple things well, very well, in fact, and he rarely makes mistakes. A bit of a, a throwback to some of the defenders I played with back in the day. Good leader, too. Yeah, I'm inclined to agree. a routine save he had to be very switched on there Short, drilled in low. Great reaction. He's done very well to get to that. That wasn't the easiest of saves by any means, Peter. And I think his instincts were, well, they were just razor sharp. De Bruyne with the short one. enough to concern the defence. Haaland. Now it's Foden. Who's going to make this theirs? Dicks one in. Oh, delightful ball. Big chance! One-on-one! -on -one. Goal! Arsenal! Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Yeah, he always had the measure of the keeper, and there was very little doubt as to how this was going to end up. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Locks it towards the front. Sinchenko has a long pass towards the front. Saliba. goal to give them a 1-0 lead now can he finish can he score well, the balls come loose and the chase is on white chance Not offside that time I'm not sure about that call, you know, but we get to see replays. De Bruyne. Foden. Haaland. Now it's Rodri. Foden. Odegaard. There's no 
first 45 minutes are up. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well. There's good movement off the ball. The passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Arsenal go in at half time with a slender one goal lead. And the action is back on the way. Well, 1 0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Attempts. Zinchenko, Rice, now can he capitalise? What about it? A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe. An exhibition in how to finish with a minimum of fuss. Arsenal themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Oh, that's... Now that's from the goal kick. Looks like a good ball through. Shut a goal! Surely that settles it. Yeah, I love the finish, but I think had the pass been delayed for just a second longer, I think he would have been flagged offside. And I think you have to praise them all round on that one from the pass and the finish. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Who's getting there? Harvats. Oh, it's the route one option. Passes it through. Havertz. Passes it square. Fitz has got rid of that. Rice. Manchester City uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. And out to safety. Rotary. It's the sort of defending that is going to upset the opposition already has actually yeah and the fact that he's registered Peter simply encourages more attention of um, of a, a closer nature Manchester City have chosen to bring on the last of their substitutes well his stamina was called into question then but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in he was very willing though not quite able Odegaard Havertz looks to slip it through it's a great ball. He'll have a dip. That is a class save. He had to be at his best. Rodri. Time added on four minutes. Havertz. Can he put it away? <laughs> Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. A demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. Your reflections then, Jim. Of course, we all love to watch the creative...